Hey everyone, it's Joan and it's Monday. And I got a uh, huge package of crafting goods, mostly crafting goods, from Kimmy MacWish and Two, and I'll put her link below. She does makeup and craft, etc. hauls and videos and stuff. So um I already did this, but then I realized I forgot a couple of things, so I'm going to get the things, at least this one, that I forgot. Um, show this right away. It's called a Painty Twin. It's Zig Painty Twin. And on one end, it is called Forest, which is a green, and on the other, it's Burgundy, which is a red. So I've never seen this before, so I'm really curious and excited to use it. It's going to be awesome for Christmas. Um, and, of course, anything else, obviously. I had mentioned um, in one of my videos that I was going to do a 12 by 12 album for my daughter and her husband. And um, so Kimmy sent me a bunch of uh, white, red, and black paper for my album. I've never done one before. But these, I think, are 8 by 8 and they may be from the uh, Immortal Love. Hi. How are you, Roxy? The Immortal Love um, album that I had, uh, album, stack that I had sent her. Uh, these stickers are going to be perfect. Look at those. Hi, Rox. That's my big girl. Huh? She sent me this. Isn't that beautiful? These here, they're this one at least is a one-sided paper. Black and white with the doves and then different shades of gray. Uh, this one is called Flower Bonanza Cinnamon Stick. It's by Fiskers, Cloud9 designed by Fiskers. In the back is a beautiful brown color. Uh, these are single. <laughs> Roxy's just down here. Look at how beautiful that is. My problem is going to be trying to figure out which papers to use. They're all so beautiful, and who knows, maybe I'll use all of them. Look at that one. How gorgeous is that? Oh, Rock, you just knocked one of my tapes down. There's this, and that on the back. These are Story of Us. It's easy as one, two, three. Look at these, how beautiful are these? They're like a taupe, a cream and a taupe color. And very satiny. Um, this would be really pretty for accents. She sent me two of these. These are like an 8 by 11. One of these. I'd love to have a shirt made out of fabric. This is black with a very soft, muted, silver, like Swiss dot pattern. This is gorgeous. Uh, flowers, red flowers, and they are in different rectangle shapes, so you can cut them out and actually use them as photo mats if you want. This one is absolutely gorgeous. This is a double-sided one. Look at how pretty that is. But then you turn it over, and look at that. It has some writing on it, although I haven't taken the time to look at it. This one, this is brown, I believe. Oh, maybe it's black. I don't know. Sometimes I have a hard time distinguishing. And then red on the back. This one, you guys, is so freaking cool. I love this one. Kimmy, where did this one come from? I haven't seen this before. Look at her glittery fairy wings. Um, this is beautiful. Little flowers. And in the center of the flower, it's glittery. Now these are double sided, has a uh, silver on the back, and this is more of a taupey brown color on the back, and then this one, aren't they gorgeous? Kimmy, thank you, thank you, thank you so much, girl. Um, and to go along with that, she sent a bag full of... Um, these little red rose petals. This beautiful ribbon trim, the red. 
uh, some of these tags, shipping tags, um, and then this ribbon. This ribbon, <laughs> a stack of white doilies. I'm not going to have to get anything or provide anything for this album, Kimmy. I think you provided everything for me. You're such a dear, sweet friend. Um, diamond glass. And I'm going to be honest, I'm not really sure how to use this. Do you just stick it on with, you know, put some glue down and um, do that? I don't know. She sent me this bag. Well, she actually sent me two bags full of beautiful beads and uh, cool trims and brads and buttons. Um, look at these. They're like big brads. It's a butterfly. Where are my doilies? They're a good backdrop. A butterfly. They're metal. And a star. And uh, a snowflake. Just a whole assortment of things. Then in another bag she sent me some bottle caps. Um, these beautiful paper flowers. You know, maybe it would have been better if I would have done this on the table. It probably would have been. Sorry, you guys. Two of these really cool um, paper clips. And then these are really cool. Uh, white and black little people. Um, this awesome clip. I had found some of these um, at Dollar Tree and I've used them in my tags quite a bit so I'm really happy to get some more and that, those are even more substantial um, than the ones that I have. Look at this one, the red foot. How cute is that? I think I should have showed you these on the table. Oh well. And then these metal tags. I, um, you put it over the edge of your paper, I guess, and then crimp it shut or just squeeze it shut. It says thanks. I don't have any of those. This awesome metal um, embellishment. Pretty bouquet of flowers. So that will be pretty for the album. I set that over there. So just this assortment of awesome, cool, oh, and then look at this, this little paper clip. I found a lot of these really cool paper clips at Office Max or Office Depot or whatever it was. Um, here is a little ribbon. It's a satin ribbon, and it's in blues. The background is blue and then different colored dots. Um... I'm not, is this tape? I, I'm confessing my ignorance here. Really cool. That would be great for the album. Um, this awesome coppery, it's like eyelash yarn is what I'm calling it. I don't know if that's really what it is, but that's what it reminds me of. Okay. This bag full of beautiful cut out flowers and blues and greens and browns. And I'm doing a bird album in those colors so some of these will probably end up in my bird album. As well as, you know, maybe some of those. This awesome little, little stamp that says, it's so tiny, the script is, to plant a seed is a hopeful deed. And then this one, I d this is so cute, the Little Classic Rubber Stamp by Hampton Art, and it's bird's feet. How flippin' cute is that? Oh, she also sent me a bag full of these cutouts, all these different cutouts, a heart and all these different presents. Those would be awesome for um, birthday cards, because I've gotten into card making now, too. Um, this bag full of tags, of uh, cardstock tags in all different colors. Perfect for cards and whatever. This um, bias tape, is that color not beautiful? I have to start switching up what I'm saying because I keep repeating myself. But that is a gorgeous color. Love it! 
Oh, these two little Valentine, little tiny punches. One is the Cupid and one is the heart. I know I'm going fast, but I've got, you guys, I may be half through. Um, these two ribbons, how pretty for spring and summer and Easter cards, albums, some vintage, and this is the real deal, light blue writes rickrack, mercerized cotton, and I know it's vintage because it's 15 cents. She also got me a bunch of chipboard albums. Um, Suji had said that we were having a hard time finding them. So she sent me this one. It reminds me of Mickey Mouse, but the picture here shows it sideways. Uh, this one I think is so flipping cute. Look at that, a little chair. An easy chair. And then a flower shape. Yeah, in Las Vegas and here in Alaska, we have a hard time getting or finding them. They either aren't stocking them or they sell out right away. She sent me two of these beautiful note cards that you can uh, embellish. And I've got a bunch of all those cutouts to uh, make some awesome cards with. This is a Playful Boy brag book. Martha Stewart. No, this is EK Success. Yeah, oh, Martha Stewart by EK Success. Sorry. So I'm hoping that this is going to be prophetic. I want a grandbaby. Whenever Liz and Brian decide the time is right. And I don't care if it's a boy or a girl. Wedding favor trim. Perfect for the album. I keep sticking the stuff for the album over there. These uh, green gems. This beautiful baker's twine. And it's white with a black stripe going through it. I don't have any of this, so I'm really happy to have that. Um, a whole bag full of these gold colored sequins. Um, she sent me a bag full of these, I think Sue J called them skeleton leaves, is that what they're called? Aren't they gorgeous? I don't know if these are recollections or I am roses or where you got them Kimmy, but they're beautiful and some of those are going to be going on the wedding album too. She sent me two of these really neat envelopes. Those would be really nice for tags. Uh, two of these adorable teddy bear bags. So again, I'm hoping that this is a little prophetic and maybe I have a little grandson or granddaughter. Uh, these, oh, I, th I just love these. These vintage bags, like turn of the century Victorian designs and um, pictures and ads. I love those. This bag of these adorable, um, they're almost like holographic. They're crowns. There's that blue, and then there's a hot pink, and there's silver. Those are really cute. Again, adorable for birthday cards. These I just love. Look at this one. These tags. And then this one kind of cracked me up because it's uh, the date stamp says Milwaukee, and that's where my son-in-law is from. We're from Madison. We moved here from Madison. She sent me this really cute Christmas slash winter stamp clear stamp set. There's a um, snowman, a tree, and it says joy. Um, oh, Roxy, where's the tag? I hope she didn't eat it. Hang on, guys. I have to bend over. Did you eat my tag? Oh, did you just whack your head? Poor Roxy. She was born, uh, well, we've had her almost a year now, but we had to get her eyes fixed twice. She had a condition called entropion, where the eyelids roll in and the eyes get scratched by the lashes, and so she has scarring on her corneas, the poor thing. She sent me, I have to save these bags so I can send stuff back. She sent me a bunch of these adage or adage tags, I'm not sure how you pronounce it, but I didn't have any of these either, so I'm really excited to have these. These would be really cute in the wedding album. 
Thank you, thank you, thank you, Kimmy. Um, two of these awesome little boxes. Look at, see? And then they, um, Kimmy, did you make these? Do you have a, a, a Cricut cartridge for these? Or did you buy them? Or a, um, oh, there's food on the bottom, but how cute are these? These would be so cute for, um, little gifts, um, or just to decorate and have. These awesome rub-ons from Michaels, and they have this stick. Uh, these stickers, which are going to be perfect for the wedding album. Kimmy, you are such a sweetheart. You're such an awesome friend. Um, another Martha Stewart Elegant Cloud Brag Book. Look at that. I love these colors. There aren't too many colors or color combinations I don't love. And she sent me this whole big thing of blue fibers and with light green um, accents in there. And I'm just kind of chuckling because she sent me a lot of blue stuff and I know she doesn't like blue. So I don't know, maybe she's cleaning out her stash of blue, which is fine with me. I love all the colors. Um, oh, shoot. I'm mixing that up with that. I'm making a mess. This is the card that she sent me that she made. Isn't that beautiful? She loves the distressed kind of dirty look. Um, this is... Is it metal, Kimmy? I don't know. And I'm guessing she used alcohol ink on it, but I don't know. I have to get some because I don't have any. And I've been watching um, Tim Coffey's videos, and he just had one up um, where he made these beautiful flowers out of, uh, like, Michael's plastic bags. So, and it says hi. And then she wrote, a, of course, a beautiful note inside and stamped with handmade with love. Ah, uh, this I forgot to show you last time, and I can't believe it. Look at this tag. She had shown some of these in one of her videos, a video of the the projects that she was working on, and I just, I just love this. I just think it is absolutely gorgeous. So now I have to figure out where, how I'm going to display, you know, the cards and beautiful things that my friends are making and sending to me. Um... I know Sue J has hers all set up. She put in an order a long time ago for I am Ro to I am roses for flowers, and she kept saying that she was going to wait for those to come before she shipped my box because she wanted to include some. And she said she wasn't getting it and wasn't getting it. And then she finally um, emailed or contacted uh, the person that I am roses, and so they resent her order. And she is such a wonderful and generous, loving person that she shared. Look at these. I'm going to have to order some of these, seriously. These are beautiful. Those are white. And then two of the little tiny white roses. And, of course, these are going in the album. Maybe all of them. Maybe not. Maybe I'll hoard some. How beautiful are these? They are a, a brown color, and it has just a hint of purple in the brown, and then the uh, lighter color is like a blush color. Absolutely gorgeous. Two bouquets of the little tiny black. Let me hold something behind. Little black roses. Two of those. And then this one, and I hope that the light will pick up the color. These are like a midnight blue. They're almost black, but they are just gorgeous. Beautiful. And she sent me two things of makeup. This little Clinique lip palette. And Rose Spectrum Bamboo Pink and Blushing Coral. And it comes... Is that a little brush? Oh, how cute. A little... uh lip brush. With, it's retractable. And these are the colors. And it has a mirror, but I'm going to cover it up for you. 
Look at those. Those are beautiful. How perfect just to put... I'm going to keep this at my station at work because I'm always looking for my lip gloss, my lipstick. Yeah. And I can't put it in my pocket because then it gets full of hair, which is no fun. You pull out your lip gloss and it's all hairy. She sent me one of these uh, Wet n Wild Color Icon pencils in taupe, which is the one that I wear all the time. And I hope I got everything this time, Kimmy. Um, did I show you this? The big bag of trim and all the buttons. Look at that. I don't know if I showed you that. I apologize if I did. Uh, so I think that is everything. Is that not a huge haul? Um, I'm going to try to get some more videos out this week. I'm off the next couple of days. You know, I'd had my surgery, was recovering. Um, and then my husband's family was here, and they had a riot. We had a riot with them. I know his cousin and his wife and their daughter are some of the nicest people you'll ever meet, but their friends that they brought with them, exactly the same. We just had an awesome time. And they, you know, went out and did their own thing, the sightseeing stuff, and we got together with them a few times. But um, we're planning on driving down to California from Las Vegas at some point. It's only about a four-hour drive. So you guys take care. Hope you're having a wonderful Monday, unless that's an oxymoron. Mine are usually pretty good because I don't work Mondays, but, um, hi Roxy. Well, maybe I'll show you Roxy. Here's Roxy. Say hi, everyone. Say hi. Say thank you, Kimmy. I may have eaten one of the tags. Let me stand up. She's so big. Huh? Roxy. Hi. Oh, no, no, no. Don't knock it. Oh, she's knocking everything over. Anyway, there's my stash, my haul. So, you guys take care. And I will just talk to you soon. Hope to get some more videos out um, this week. Okay. Love you. Bye.